We're back at Benedict's. This is a good breakfast joint. I'm trying to learn how to eat left-handed. Jerry's working on left-handed tools. And it's raining today. So we're going to probably take it easy until it clears off. Maybe this afternoon. You never know, though. We might try to find another bike shop. I don't know. As long as it's not clear across the country. Crab cake, eggs, vinegar. Salmon, salmon. Salmon. salmon eggs man because he's boring. Bicycle outfitters. I don't know. At least this one I know I wouldn't be able to fall over. Bicycle outfitters. Look how that one folds up. They've got recumbents. Yeah, a lot of Bontrager and Trek equipment. Hey, Jerry, look right in there. Gloves, clothing, lots of different bikes. Crazy, crazy cool stuff. Neat shop. These guys are right on sort of the middle, right in here, of the Pinellas Trail. If you come out on the Pinellas, you can come here. You can stop. If you need bike work done, you get a full shop back here. Dogs. <laughs> And trail access, snacks. You walk out this door, and right here is the Pinellas Trail. Right out there by the bike, by the by the bike shop. It's awesome. They've got bikes for rent that you can rent and take out on the trail. Neat place. So. The weather's improving. The yeah. clouds have kind of kind of broken apart. And we still have a little bit of sunshine and there's some water here. Look at that. Huh. Huh. How about that? But we're still in traffic. <laughs> yeah. I'll take it. Traffic and sunshine is okay. We're on our way. We're gonna get on the Pinellas Trail. We're gonna head north, which is one direction we haven't gone. So we're gonna do that. Leaving the house. Jerry's got all his gear on, got his Ortley bags on. So we're gonna check it out. Well, you What's know. This guy? What's this guy doing? He's huffing. He's huffing and puffing, Take paddling. He's pedaling with all the car. Oh, the darkness. He's pedaling with all this cargo now. Yeah. He's doing a little belly. It's like he's touring. It's crazy. This guy's working while he's biking. Can you believe that? Working and biking. What the heck? Afternoon. Howdy. The northern end of the Pinellas Trail. There we go. This is John Chesnut Jr. Park that's at the northern end of the Pinellas Trail. Which is funny because the trail's heading south at its northern end. Yes, it is heading <laughs> south at its northern end, but so be it, I guess. Nice park. It's pretty out here. So this is Tarpon Lake. Lake Tarpon, something like that. Looks like we've gone about uh, 14 miles from where we started. So, nice little ride up here to the northern end. John Chestnut Sr. Park. Jerry had the small panniers on, put a little stuff in there just to get a little more workout. I'm working on getting some stuff together. And there goes his bike. 
So even though you get this double kickstand like old Jerry's got on his bike there, still in this soft dirt, that thing will sink in and just fall over with the weight. So you always got to be careful. Interesting too with this bag on there and the weight he's got in there, the steering wheel gets up in the air, it just wants to fall over. So you got to really be careful. Pretty tipsy. Maybe the maybe the tree's not such a bad idea, huh? So anyway, I got this Revlet bag on there. It's a mountain feed bag. I really like it, but it may change my philosophy on what I do with this this bag if I try to do a top two bag. I don't know what I'm going to do with this. I'm, I don't know if I'm going to keep it or get rid of it. I find I'm using it less and less now, and I think if I had a top two bag here, I would just stick my phone in there maybe because I don't uh, access my phone that often. So we'll see. More to come for sure. We're on our way back. We're going 15 miles or so. Yeah. We're going to see if we can find a cider and a sticker. <laughs> That's right. So we're at the Tarpon Tavern. This is a key lime cider. Yeah. It's called. Pretty good. Pretty tasty. We found one. First stop. Kind of refreshing. Lucky, I'd say. Unfortunately, no stickers. No stickers here. No stickers. We're going to work on that, though. We're giving them input. We need some stickers. Sitting outside in Tarpon Springs. We're back in our neighborhood. Go down here and check out the Crystal Beach access. There's a pier down here. It's pretty though. Still got this guy. Well, 30 miles, right? Yep. All the way up north to the start of the north end of the trail, or end of the north end of the trail, depending on how you look at it. And back to the house. Yep. So right at 30 miles. Good day. Turned out to be a nice afternoon after a rainy morning. Yep. I'm glad we got to capitalize on some nice weather. Yeah. So, the deal is, is that we've been instructed that we need to go get some stone crab. Now, if you've never had stone crab, both of us are going to advise you to strongly consider the next time you're in Florida and it's in season and you can get it, you should be there. And season usually runs during the fall, winter, spring kind of time. Yeah. Go get some stone crab, go to any seafood place, but make sure if you get stone crab, you get the mustard sauce with it, yep. right? Absolutely. Now, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, mustard sauce? You dudes are nuts. But I'm telling you, the mustard sauce is the bomb. You must have it with the stone crab. There's, it just works. I don't know why. It's kind of like a cross between a, a mayo mustard, sort of creamy, ranchy sort of thing. Yeah, it's, it's life changing. You yeah. can't, you can't uh, allow another season to pass without trying this stuff. So we're doing as we're told. We're gonna go get some stone crab. We're going back to Ward's Seafood Market. Showed you that in a video, I think, yesterday, maybe, or the day before yesterday, I don't know. The days are running together, but we're off to do it because, well, we've been told to. So there you go. We're back at Ward's Seafood. This place is awesome. So is that purple Hummer. Look at that. Look at that. Keep going. <laughs> I'm going. <laughs> ah, it's perfect. Go. What, are you, what are you eating there? The most delicious nectar ever. What is it? It's stone crab. Show us a claw. Stone crab. Pow. Look at the size of those Here things. Oh, 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 oh. Super jumbo. Oh, Super Jumbo Colossal Stone Crab Claws. Which is bigger than Jumbo. Yeah. 
Good stuff.